The Australian Competition and Consumer Commission has its say on the ongoing Qatar Airways debate. Three are arrested on charges of theft at a private property in Qatar. Qatari-based firm Estethmar Holding has announced an expansion into Jordan. And finally, Paris Saint-Germain is ready to kickstart the new season with 11 new talents in the squad. Hi, it's Adi. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. The Australian Competition and Consumer Commission has finally entered into an aviation debate that has caused turbulence across the country. The competition watchdog said allowing Qatar Airways to add more weekly flights at Australian airports would have made fares cheaper. The comments debunked claims by Qantas, whose CEO said it would not have affected rates. Australia's government has faced intense scrutiny since blocking a request by Qatar Airways to add 21 more flights into the country. The government has cited national interest as a reason for its decision, but has failed to clarify further. The ACC now joins growing calls to reverse the controversial decision. Now, here in Qatar, the Ministry of Interior has arrested three Arab individuals for robberies at private properties. They targeted homes in Umm Salal and Al Khisa. Now, the three face legal measures that could see them behind bars. In business, Istithmar Holding has announced the establishment of a new subsidiary company in Jordan. The newly named MENA Facilities Management has been established in partnership with the Jordanian Total Care Facilities Company. The Qatari company has continued to expand across the region, most recently announcing major projects in Iraq. And finally, following the departures of megastars Lionel Messi, Neymar and Sergio Ramos, Paris Saint-Germain has signed 11 brand new players for the season. Speaking ahead of Sunday's League One game against Lyon, Spanish coach Luis Enrique said, we couldn't have planned a better scenario. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.